So we now have a new version of Lightroom Classic and that's version 10. And the interesting thing that I discovered was that there seems to be some change in the masking. I generally use Lightroom for masking, cleaning up, raw processing and avoid Photoshop as far as possible unless I'm doing a composite which Lightroom cannot do. So I was about to export this particular image to demonstrate uh, masking in Lightroom for one of my friends. And if I just do a view on this, it still looks fine. This was done in version 9. But if I go into the develop mode, the mask seems to have changed somewhat so let's just do a shortcut of k select the mask show the mask overlay and it seems to be a perfect line which is obviously not really possible across so this somehow happened and in the process, I discovered another bug. For example, if I turn on auto mask, look at what happens to the mask in the display. Even if I turn it off, look at what happens just by dragging around. I'm not doing anything in that area, but the mask keeps changing. Okay, let's do a auto mask here. And as you can see, it keeps filling in that and keeps moving the mask around, making it practically impossible to use. And this is the all new Lightroom Classic 10. As you can see, just masking. Let's delete this mask. And let's try it again. Uh, just turn off the auto mask. And let's see. It's pretty slow compared to version 9. Actually, perceptibly slower. And now. Let's decrease the brush size, turn auto mask on, and once again we can see that same effect. And this generally happens when you've more or less completed masking of most of the image. So now you really don't know what is happening. So this seems to be a serious enough bug. Hopefully this will be corrected in the next release. But till such time, I guess it is good to be aware that this is a bug. That's it for now. Have fun. Till the next one.